Dr. Mark Meakin has been studying whale sharks at Ningaloo for 20 years. He's found a way to stop these giants in the water by picking parasites off their mouths, like a cleaner fish. The animal pulls up, the scientists get to work, and everybody's a winner. You've got to get in front of a moving shark to slow it down. Yeah. What could possibly go wrong? Exactly. <laughs> it's only just a giant animal. <laughs> <laughs> Mark makes it look easy. Scratching sharks has allowed him to sample their parasites, to ID them by their spots, observe their gut contents, track their journeys with satellite tags, He's taken DNA in the hope of seeing who's who out there. Today, he's trying something new. He wants to look inside them, using ultrasound to gauge their health. Whale sharks are a great indicator species. Because of the way they indiscriminately will feed as, as ram filter feeders out there, they're gathering everything that's out there, be it plastic, be it macroalgae. They're a very good indicator of the productivity and the problems of the ecosystem. I've been swimming with whale sharks for 30 years. One fundamental rule, don't touch. So I'm a bit hesitant, but I'll do it for science. This is like hanging off the front of a moving bus. A moment of trust for both of us. <laughs> <laughs>